black jumped here, but with this move, black could have captured this one's turn. It would have been much better for black. Because in the actual game, as you see, white played this move, it was very powerful. So now the upper right corner, black has some greater weakness. Black answered on this side, but it would have been better for black just giving up the left side because black has still a large territory over here, so it was good enough for black. But black answered on this side, so white managed to reduce the gap. Now you see white managed to break the upper right corner. We can compare you see now white group is in danger and black has a large territory over here, but in the actual game. White got to break the upper right corner, so the game became so close. After this cut, White saved the upper right corner, and now the game is very close. Now I will give you a question. For Black, where is the biggest place? Black to play, where would you play if you were Black? I will give you several options a b in the actual game black player played on this side but the biggest place is over here yeah we should play the most open space right if black plays here, probably black can make some territory over here, but it looks not that big. This area is much bigger. But white didn't play on the lower left corner. Actually, this attach is not working because black can cut. But black stepped back, so the sequence went like this. Of course, with this move, white could have played on this side, this or this, and after this, for black, black could have played here as well, but black played on this side. Yeah, now for this move, white could have played on this side, and with this move, of course, black could have played on this side. My point is always you should check that here is the biggest or not. I mean, you don't have to follow your opponent's move. You can play away. But both players played on the right side, but it was not that big. And now white invaded on the lower right corner, but the lower Left corner was much bigger. I can enclosure like this or this. Anywhere around here is okay. But white invaded on the lower right corner. Now white played this tiger's mouse, but white could have played just like this and could have play the way. Even if black plays honey and connect, white has this move, white can connect underneath. So actually with only this exchange, the lower right corner white stone white group is alive. Yeah actually this is amazing. But white made a tiger's mouse so now white 
had to play one more stone, it was a exactly one move loss. You see, black played on the side, but of course, as I told you, the corner is bigger. Fortunately, white got to play on this side. Now the game is very close. The sequence went like this. Black is trying to make the center as black's territory, but usually making the center as a territory is not that easy. So with this move for black, black could have played on the left side. Black can play Atari or it seems like black can just jump. Now that black didn't play on this side, white could have connected here and exchanged this. But in the actual game, my student played on the center. Both players are trying to play on the center, but actually this side was bigger, you see? Yeah, from this moment, it seems like both players think center is bigger, but actually this side was bigger. Now the game is very close, so for black, this side is so big, you know, but black tries to cut on this side, but it was not working. And yeah, both players are playing on the right side, but the main point was the left side. After several seconds, my student had a great chance. Yeah, now white could have captured these four and five stones. This is white's turn. Where should white play? In the actual game, my student just played like this and white allowed black to save this four stones. But with this move, white could have cut here. Then white could have captured these four stones. Yeah, it was so sad. Now my student tried to do something on the right side. It seems like my student got tilted because uh, these are captured. But white could have played calmly. For example, black could have captured this one stone and could have played on this side. Now the game is still close, but my student tried to do something on the right side, but it was not working. So after several sequences, my student got captured all this group. Yeah, the game was not that bad for my student, but somehow my student got uh, upset or something. So he started rushing, you know. I mean, even at this moment, White could have played here. All right, how was today's game? I introduced a old variation about this attach. When Black plays here, White has two options. One way is to connect here and the other way is cut and capture this one stone. And before starting a call, I can exchange this and I can start a call and connect here as a call thread. Black played so well. For both player, this was a vital point. Black was leading a lot, but on the upper right corner, Black missed this part. 
So white managed to break the upper right corner. So, so the game became so close. And then both players didn't see the lower left corner and both players started playing on the right side and it moved to the lower right corner and finally white got to play on the lower left corner but white missed some good chance white could have cut here it was a big chance but even after this white could have played normally you know but my student got upset or something so the whole the upper right group is captured yeah all right how was today's game with this game i'm not sure how strong my student is so let me check another game i hope you enjoyed this video i'll see you in the next video bye